Hi, I come back to you again. Um, today I have a quick question. And my question is, the issue of bond notes that the government insists on uh, using, and uh, there's been a public outcry to say we don't want the bond notes from the people for the simple reason that people are afraid of going back to 2008 and time uh, before that. And the, the government seems to be responding uh, and saying that um, uh, they promised people that we're not going to go back to 2008, we're not going to introduce, reintroduce the Zim dollar, um, and they're assuring us of that. My question is, if the government goes against what people are saying, people are not interested in the bond notes, and they, if they go ahead and print those bond notes, and impose them on the people. What is going to stop them from imposing the Zim dollars then at some point? Where is the, the trust going to be built if our government cannot respect people's voices now? How do we trust that at some point somebody is not going to wake up and say, well, today we want to introduce Zim dollar. Is there a mechanism that ensures that the voices of people I heard are considered because the last time I listened to a, a government minister about this issue they said we are inquiring we want to hear people's opinions but there's been a public outcry to say we don't want those is there some respect for people's opinions in this country thank you